Hello YouTube, it's 4 in the morning but science never sleeps. So this is my meddling into the cold fusion um, with this experiment. So uh, this is the cold fusion experiment. So we have a variac um, going to um, 200 volt cap uh, capacitor and going into um, transformer, 1 to 4 transformer. So the um, low voltage goes into the AC and then the high voltage comes out and goes into another capacitor and then uh, that uh, goes into a bridge rectifier and the output of a bridge rectifier goes into um, a thermal resistant container filled with um, water and uh, table salt and negative must be four times slower than the positive so this is very dangerous experiment so you guys don't try this at home this is the um, bridge rectifier that I'm using is 100 amps it's rated for um, 1000 1, volts so it's 1000 volts 100 amps and this is my bath and inside I have um, two electrodes made out of aluminum and um, and if you don't use these capacitors like if you don't put a capacitor there or, or there in series you're going to smoke your uh, transformer and actually uh, that actually happened to me so you're gonna smell it burning so I actually have a lot of ex other experiments uh, going on I, I, uh, so besides that one there's many other things I'm doing this, this is a giant PMH that I'm working on I just uh, wanna want you guys to see this one in particular so okay here we go we're gonna start um, on very low voltage okay Flip it on. Check this out. So I'm slowly going to increase the uh, potentiometer. Um, I mean the variac. I'm sorry. And you can really see the reaction going. Okay, I actually burned off the electrode, that's why it stopped. And um, th there's reports of new elements being found, like uh, reports of uh, silica being found uh, at the bottom if you're using uh, aluminum electrodes. So that indicates transmutation. So you have hydrogen b uh, atoms or protons being deposited on your um, aluminum, transforming it into silicon. So if you look, um, on the periodic table, as you know, silicon has one more um, protons than aluminum. So okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna fix the electrodes. And I'm gonna do this again. Yeah. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Let's see this thing in action again. Let's see. Variac is jumping, it's making, uh, but has, has a vibration to it. We are at 39 volts in the Variac, so that's 1 to 4. Okay, a transformer starts to smoke.